if Jesus tarries and, 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 and doesn't come until I'm 90 years old, I'm still going to be talking like this. I've been saying this thing since I was in the, in the secondary school. I said, if I grow up to be 90, I'm still going to be shouting and jumping. That's what I, that's what I plan. That's what I plan for. If I get to be 90 before Jesus comes. Christianity is the miraculous life the divine nature that God has given to us in Christ Jesus. The reason you feel the things you feel and suffer the things you suffer is because you have listened for too long to the natural men of this life. It is difficult because of your knowledge of the world to walk in the light of God's word. But the Bible says if we walk in the light as he is in the light we have fellowship one with another and the blood of jesus christ is uncleansed us from our sin if we walk in the light of our hands if we walk in the light of our divine nature oh if you could only believe this if you could only believe this by the time i ask you to get up from your chair you will get up and all the pain and all the sickness and all the evil with which you came will be left behind so that's what i'm sharing with you that's what I'm sharing with you. Let the word of God fly you on eagle's wings. Don't allow the system of this world to dominate you. Look up. Look higher. Learn to take God's word seriously. That is what you need. That's what you need in your life. If you have it, let me tell you, if you have it, no matter what you go through in life, Bible says put on the whole armor of God that ye may be able to stand against the wires, the stratagems of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. It says, wherefore take unto you the whole armor. Take it unto you. Put it on. And I particularly like it when he says, and having done all, to remain what? Standing. Because some people fight and fall. But it is the one who remains standing that wins. Not the one that threw the heaviest punches. It's the one who at the end remains standing. It says, having done all, stand. And this is the only thing that can keep you standing. So that you do works that count. Works that remain things that last for eternity learn to meditate on jesus meditate on what he did for you on that salvation you are special are you hearing me it took that much to save you you are special some people say your nose is too big but you are special to god for some your eyes are too big but to god you are what special for some people, your head is too big. It should have been smaller. But to God, you are what? Special. Never condemn yourself. Find value in yourself. Don't wish you were somebody else. Live your life for the master. Live your life for him. The time is short. If God gave you 200 years to live, they will still come to an end. There were some people who lived more than 900 years. They're not here anymore. The years went like a dream. I remember listening to Captain Coogan. She said, where have the years gone? She remembered when she was a, a little girl. And suddenly, she was much older now. And the wrinkles were there. She was a grown woman. And she said to herself, where have the years gone? One day, you're going to be thinking, where the years gone but if you want to account for those years then act now do what you must now now is the time to live for yourself live to please Jesus Christ